This is the eighth grade TCAP practice test. This is question number 58. Um, Javier will sort the four equations shown by classifying them as linear or nonlinear. y equals 1, x plus y equals 3, y is equal to 2 minus x to the third, and x is equal to 6. Which shows the correct way Javier should sort the above equation? Well, first off, I need to know that anything with an exponent on it, if it's a variable, when I'm graphing, makes it so it's nonlinear. If you want to test them, you can graph all of these except x is equal to 6 in your calculator with no problem. So if I have, um, I just need to change this one, the x plus y equals 3, into subtract x from both sides, and it makes it negative x plus 3. So you can graph y equals 1 in your calculator. You can graph y equals negative x plus 3. And you can go ahead and graph y is equal to 2x minus x to the third power. And you'll get some graph that looks a little bit like this. What, uh, by the way, what uh, nonlinear means is it's not a straight line. Y is equal to negative x plus 3 looks a little bit like this. Y is equal to 1 will end up looking a lot like this. Now, the x thing you can't graph on the calculator, but if you just have x on the axis, or x by itself, and you're trying to graph it, go to the x axis to where 6 is. So, there's, so let's say 6 is here. That's the worst drawn scale ever, but you're just going to have to pretend. It'll be a straight up and down line, just like the y equals is a straight line. So it looks like here is a linear, here is a linear, and here is a linear, and my only nonlinear term is the last one. So what you're looking for with linear versus nonlinear, everything with just uh, without an exponent on it is generally linear. Anything with x squared, x to the third power, blah, 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 that's going to be nonlinear. S says the only linear term is x is equal to 6. That's not true. Uh, G says that e the x equal to 6 and y is equal to 1, things are linear. But then it has x plus y equals 3 being nonlinear. Well, that's not true. It's a straight line. You can graph it yourself. Uh, so we're going to look at h. h says that x plus y is equal to 3 is nonlinear. It also says that y minus 2x minus x to the third power, or y equals 2 minus x to the third power, is linear, which is not true. We just showed you. It's that little curvy thing. And the last one, y is equal to 1 x plus y equals 3, x equals 6 is linear. All those are linear, not is linear, are linear. And uh, y is equal to 2x minus x to the third power is nonlinear, and that's true. So the answer uh, to this question is just j.